What's up guys, welcome to your 60 second Android tutorial for the new Boston. And you know what you guys are ready for? You're ready for some graphics. You know, some simple animations, some stuff for you're gonna need for games and all that other all that other great stuff. So let's create a new class real quick and call it GFX. I don't know. For graphics. And uh, you know, as always, what we need to do is we need to go into the manifest and define this new class. I'm gonna just select one of these smaller ones here. Copy, paste, GFX, and save that, as well as go into our menu and also do GFX here. Just get everything set up. And this this little series here within this greater series that we're doing is probably going to take a few tutorials just to get everything going and kind of getting you guys to understand the basic concepts of graphics. You don't see a lot of like game tutorials online because it gets pretty complex and it's kind of hard to, you know, describe everything that's going on. So it's going to be fairly simple. We're just going to be working with animation simply um, at the, at this time. I don't know how much time I'm going to go into the gaming stuff. I will on my channel at my bring back, but uh, just because I, I kind of want to teach you guys Android in its entirety for the most part, I don't know how much time we're going to have for all this good stuff. But we're going to do graphics and we're going to say extends activity, just as always. And uh, there we go, we got to import activity. And we're going to also do the on create method. So, you guys should know how to do that by now. And uh, click that and hit OK. And then what we're going to do is basically set up a new variable, uh, which will be a variable that we're going to define in a different class that we're going to create ourselves. So, we're going to call this my bring back. And again, class name should be uppercase. So, we're going to do my bring back like this. And we're going to call this our view. That's the name of the view. And this is the type of variable it is. Right now it's giving us an error because it's like, hey, I don't know what class this is coming from. What are you talking about? We're going to define that in the next tutorial. But basically what we're doing is we're setting up our own custom view that's going to hold our animation. So now what we're going to do is say our view, which is that variable we set up that can work within this whole class. We're going to say new uh, my bring back and then we're going to pass in this. So again, as of now, this means nothing. The computer is like, what's going on? You're confusing me. I'm going crazy. But you know, it's going to all work out here. So we're going to say set content view now equal to our view. And there we go. I mean, we're pretty much done with this tutorial. Got all sorts of errors. No one knows what's going on. But basically, um, <laughs> basically, all we, uh, all I want to show you guys is we can create a new class and pass that class in and kind of, you know, define it. Uh, as well as, you know, you guys might get familiar with this new that we've used before, and also what this is, and kind of passing information along and how it relates to the actual class. So this, these, this little series is going to be pretty beneficial for you guys, but as of now, I know it's kind of confusing. So I'll catch you guys in the next tutorial. Have a good one. Peace.